All right, we're in Bitwig. What are we doing in Bitwig is the question. Well, we're starting a new project. Got a blank slate here. Then let's go find something fun to chuck into it. Why don't we go to samples and clips and use the browser to search for something fun that we like just by describing it. Let's just say electronic. Let's look for something electronic and just see what it comes up with to give us some ideas. Yeah, it's under everything. It don't, well, it doesn't have much, but what are these? <laughs> It's weird. Ooh, I think that's a great intro. I'm going to just chuck that into a a little cell there. What else do we got? Weird. Weird. Weirder. I don't know, but this is just cool. Dun, 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 dun. All right, and you know what? Instead of using the the um, clip launcher, let's put every, let's do everything in like a ranger view today, and we'll actually like make kind of a song. You got to hit this guy here to pop it over there. All right, here we go. So, um, and then spring in a drum beat that we make. So let's go to devices, click on device here, get rid of electronic out of our browser. Let's just bring in a drum machine. Bring it in here, actually. Let's get rid of these two. Oh, it actually put it up top, but let's just get rid of them. We got our drum machine here, and let's open up the browser with the folder. Scroll down, and I don't know, just find something cool. Uh, what's Trance Kit? Nah. Nope. I could do without that. Let's open up the browser again. What's Tight Kit? A little too tight. The mangler. That's interesting enough. Let's just use that for now. So uh, let's hit record. And let's do a little chop here. So how do we chop? Well, there's a knife tool somewhere. It's actually, if you press the five, you can do a little chop. Let's go back to the pointer tool. And uh, then let's just loop this section from there to there. So it'll start off playing from the beginning and then go into our beat. And loop, because we're turning on a loop here. Cool, cool. Of course, there's loud stuff going on. Hang on a second. You can probably still hear it, but what am I going to do? You know, I live on Earth. There's noises on Earth. Uh, let's pull in Polymer just to see what Polymer has to offer us for fun sounds. And click on the little piano guy here. Double click it. Open up the folder. Well, that's pretty cool bass. Why don't we do a little bass line? So I'm just going to hit I'm going to hit control D 2 3 so this goes four measures and this way we could have polymer play some cool bass line for like four measures. I don't know what we're going to do but let's just uh experiment with it for a little bit. Here we go. made that up um let's keep it is this snap into the grid yeah snap to the grid and let's quantize it by hitting i think in bitwig it's q or is it con alt control q Ooh, no 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 cancel that um q so let's quantize it and let's hear how it sounds Cool, cool. Let's bring in a poly synth and maybe try, try to find a cool lead sound. So let's just see what um, the presets are regarding lead. 
do we have we have synth there um, but I want to get a category of sounds so let's go to lead and what's I don't know what's this a little too weird it's a little too weird let's try something else here yeah. This is weird. Let's use it. <laughs> it's wild. So let's quantize that. All right, why don't we find a cool loop, like just a drum loop to just kind of go along with that in the background. Maybe something like this. I'm just going to drink. This is a MIDI clip. And just the beginning of it. And just don't duplicate that a bunch of times. I think that'll be fun. Oh, I'm, it's not. I didn't chop it exactly right. Let's get rid of that. Am I am I not snapping to the grid? I thought I was snapping to a grid. Okay, there we go. Let's duplicate that. Bam, 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 bam. And let's hear how that sounds now. Nice. So why don't we just bring this in there. So we're kind of like arranging a song now. Let's duplicate that. So it's it'll start off like... And now let's bring in, let's create our own little sound and bring in like a pad. If you don't know what a pad sound is, it's like, I'm, I'm just going to use Polysynth to create one. It's just a very warm, kind of soft, long-lasting sound in the background. Like, that's not a pad. Um, I'm going to make the bring the cutoff down and make your release high and your attack high. And there's... That's more of a pad. But let's add another oscillator in there. And let's add an effect, like a reverb to it, to give it a nice... I don't know, churchy kind of sound. And also before the reverb, let's put a chorus in there. There we go. Let's hit OK. And let's duplicate everything again and have the pad come in here. So now we have a song. Put this right there. And let's see what we got.
You know what I never did? I was going to end the video there, but why don't we add uh, vocals to this? Um, we haven't really done much with adding a, like an audio track. So let me work on my hip hop a little bit. This is going to be supremely embarrassing, but I don't care. It's what I do. I'm just going to spit something here. And just see what happens. So I, I created an audio track. My mic is plugged in. And it's armed to record. So it should record my voice. When you're working with Bitwig, you gotta move around, you gotta jump around, you gotta add some drums. Like hi-hat snares, everything you got going on. <laughs> oh, dude, it's terrible. It's such a white voice. Eh? I'm not keeping this in the recording, by the way. Um, yo, forget forget vocals. Pretend you didn't even hear that. Um, so that was basically what I'm doing. I can't believe I recorded that. It was so embarrassing. Basically, what I'm doing is just uh, opening up Bitwig. Open up, open up your doll like once a day and just, I don't care what you do. Just let something happen. And then, like I made something ridiculous today. Tomorrow... I might come up with a hit song, but you got to get like the, uh, you got to get the flow going. So I guess the idea of today is just, uh, start creating, start a flow and that'll get you back into it. It's like going to the gym for the first time, you know? Um, so if you haven't opened your doll in a while after this video, open up your doll and just start chucking things in. You might be asking, well, why didn't I use clip view or whatever? I don't know. I just felt like a ranger view today. Some days I feel like clip view. So, because I wanted to like uh, make, arrange it into a song. So do whatever you want, but just open your DAW once a day, get some inspiration, some stuff flowing. I know I didn't get too technical on the things in Bitwig or give any tips, but this is just what I felt like doing today. So I hope it helped something somewhere along the line. I'll see you guys.